In this video, I'll be showing you step-by-step step a super simple new method to add your custom GPTs to any website in minutes without coding. A few weeks ago, I made a video showing you how to put custom GPTs on websites, which got a huge response. There was a lot of custom code involved, which I knew many of you struggled with. So this video is supposed to be much shorter and it doesn't require any coding. By the end of this video, you'll know how to put your custom GPTs on websites in minutes so that you can level up your business with AI or build and sell custom GPTs to other businesses as an AI agency. If you are new to the channel and don't know who I am, my name is Liam Otley and I run my own AI development company called Morningside AI and I also run the largest community of AI agency owners in the world where my students learn how to make money selling AI solutions to businesses just like the website chatbot you're about to build. Let's get into it. The way we'll be creating these custom GPTs and rapidly deploying them to websites is with my new platform Agentive. Myself and the team at Morningside have created this platform to make creating, managing and deploying agents dead simple for business owners looking to utilize a workforce of AI agents or for agency owners looking to create and sell agents to other businesses. In its current state, Agenta focuses on making the testing and deploying of your custom GPTs as easy as possible. You can sign up to Agenta in the description below. It is currently 100% free for all to use. However, we do have a 48 to 72 hour wait to get in as we slowly onboard new users. So please be patient with us. In this video, I'll be creating a gold investing assistant that has a custom knowledge base of gold investing guides and a real-time gold price tool. So when I talk about assistance, I always talk about the three ingredients, prompting, knowledge, and actions. Prompting is gonna be telling it that it's an AI assistant for helping with gold investing. Then we have some knowledge-based documents for gold investing, and then we have a tool that gets the real-time gold price for us. Step one is to head to agentivehub.com, and here you can either join the waitlist or you can sign in. I'm already logged in, so I can go to here, and this is the assistant creation page. I'm going to head up to the Create Assistant button, click Create New Assistant, here we have a new assistant that's been created. Okay, so we can rename it. I'll say gold investor, gold investor assistant, V2 for me. Um, description helps me invest in gold. This is just a written description. It doesn't actually do anything for the functionality. And then for the instructions, I have a prompt ready to go that I'll paste in here. So that's all of the prompting. So ingredient one done. We can go to the tool section here, which I'll do in a second, but I want to jump to the knowledge component next. So we can upload files here and add knowledge to our knowledge base. I'm going to go here. I have uh, some documents, investing in gold, how to invest in gold and another one. So I've just grabbed these off the internet. I'm gonna stuff them all in there as knowledge base files and give this a second to upload them all. Helps to refresh and you can see them uploading. Okay, and while we're waiting for the last document here to finish processing and uploading, we can head over to creating our tool. So as I mentioned, I wanted to add a live gold price tracker. So when I'm asking my assistant for help with my gold investing, I can get the live real-time gold price. In order to create these custom functions, I need some kind of API that I can call. Now, I don't want to have to make this gold tracker myself. All I did was search up free gold price API, and I came to this one here called Metal Price API, and I signed up for a free key. And then I get to the dashboard here. So you can go metalpriceapi.com, link will be down below. I'm not sponsored by these guys at all. Um, and then we have the dashboard here, which I've gone in and created my API key, ready to go. And the next step here is actually the trickiest out of the whole lot which is we need to convert this API and this functionality into an open API spec that we can pass into Agentive in our tools section here when we go upload new tool. So in order to do this, we need to open up our good old friend ChatGPT. I can come back to the dashboard here and we need to take this information, I'll copy all of this, and I want to paste it into ChatGPT. I'll say, write me an open API um, schema for this API. Then I pass in the documentation on how to call it. And I also need to give it some examples of how it's gonna respond. So there I call it, if I run it, this is the kind of responses that it's gonna be giving. So I can copy this and say, um, this is the, an example output, paste it in there. Then what I like to do is go back to Agentive and I can go to pick an example. Let's get this predict age. I'm gonna remove that and just copy this again. Come back and say, here is an example, copy this style, exactly. Paste it in there. And then it's going to create me an open API schema for this particular API that I can pass in. Now we've generated a schema that we can paste in. There's just one thing that you may have noticed, which is the API key is being expected as an input. I would like to use my API key every time I call this, so I don't have to paste it in and use it every time I do it. So I can come down here and say, I have my API key and want to use it every time this is called. Can you please type code this in and write me the entire thing again? We can go back to our dashboard, copy the API key, paste it in there. As ChatGPT says here, it's not uh, generally recommended for security reasons, but for the sake of the tutorial, I wanna show you guys how to get this up and running as quickly as possible. So we'll just use it for now. And there we have it. You can see the default is set here. I'm gonna copy this now, head back to Agentive. 
and I'm going to delete all this and I can just paste in the specification here and it's going to automatically detect that there's a tool and now we have this get latest metal price as a tool and we can create the tool here. If we give it a second, now we have this tool provider of api.metalpriceapi.com and we're ready to give this a test. Okay, so now we can test if our tool is working. So if I go, what is the price of gold? Should call our tool and give us our answer back, which would be around 1950 or 1970 uh, US dollars per ounce. Great, so 1979.54 USD per ounce. So great, our, uh, our tools are working. Now we can test our knowledge base. So if I go, what is the best way to invest in gold on a budget? See if our knowledge base is working correctly. There we have it, giving us a bunch of information on ETFs, gold ETFs, recommending ETFs it seems. And down the bottom we can see that it's coming from our knowledge base because it has this little source market here. So knowledge base working, tools working, we're good to start putting this onto voice flow so that we can get it put onto our website. On Injective we try to make this process as easy as possible. So we have our deploy button up here which has all the details you'll need. And then we also have a little tutorial here. So if you click through, you can go to deploy into voice flow. You can watch my little tutorial here if you'd like but I'm taking you through the live version now. So what we want to do is click to on download the voice flow template, downloaded that. You can click here to sign up for an account. I've already got one, so it's going to just take me straight to the creator. Once I'm inside voice flow, I can click on the import voice flow file up here. Now, there is a 14 day free trial, I believe on voice flow. So you can get that and get instant access without having to pay anything. Um, we've imported this correctly. Now it'll be this first one here, agentive testing, load this up. And I've got a couple little annotations here. Replace your API key, replace your API key and assistant ID. So, yep, let's do that. Here we have our API key. If we go back to Agentive, we go back to our assistant. And we can go to the deploy button, the curl option. And then we have our API key here that I'm going to copy. Go back to voice flow, replace the API key down here. Same thing over here on the post request to generate a response. I'll replace the API key step there. And I'll also need to get our assistant ID, which I go back, come down here. What's my assistant ID? Copy this. And the rest of the setup has already been done in the template. We are already inserting the correct dynamic variables from the users. So now I can just make a couple edits. Let's go. I'm your gold investing assistant. I can help you with gold invest, invest right, DGs, and, uh, and can get you the current price of gold, the gold, gold ounce in USD. How can I help you today? And with that, we should be good to give this a spin. Hit the little play button, run test. Hi, how are you? Make sure you're just working on a normal question. Okay, let's go try for a tool call. What is the price of gold right now? Latest gold price is 1979.68, which means we are successfully calling our tool and getting the gold price from our API, which is great. And I think we're pretty much ready to go and pop this onto a website. We can hit escape here and then I'm going to publish it. Call this V1. Give it a second to publish. Then I'm going to embed the widget when this pops up. Now let's call it gold investor assistant. I help with gold investing. And let's uh, forget the chat history after closing the tab. Let's make it a, a gold color. Ooh, ooh, there, pretty gold. Um, launcher, have this as gold as well, sure. Assistant image, I'm just gonna keep it as a sun for now. Uh, you get the idea. Then I can come up here and copy this, pull up brackets. In this case, you'd put it onto your website, whether it's a Shopify website, whether it's a Wix website, whatever you need to do. And you can come in and add this as a script tag to your website code. So in this case, I have a templated website from the internet that I've just downloaded for an example. I'll delete this old one. Right down the very bottom, you'll see um, all this good stuff. At the bottom of most web pages, you're gonna see a bunch of script tags like this. I'm gonna dump this right into the middle of them, paste that there, give it a save, boot the website up, and down the bottom right, we have our little yellow bubble. We have our gold investor assistant. And I can ask, what is the price of gold? I don't like that white text actually. I probably would have changed it around. And it's given us back the price of gold. So the tool has obviously worked. We can ask questions about the knowledge base, etc. But that's about it for the tutorial. I hope you've been able to see the entire process and how Agenda fits into this and just how easy we are trying to make it for you when creating and deploying your assistance to different platforms. So expect a bunch more platforms coming out soon. At the moment, we're just supporting website deployments via Voiceflow. But we'll have a bunch more on the way. And if you did have any issues with getting your tool set up in the same way that I showed here of generating that schema, then be sure to subscribe to the channel because I have a bunch more content coming on tooling and how you can 
firstly understand them, but then how you can build them, how you can use other people's and stuff like that. So make sure you subscribe for that if you don't want to miss it. And down below, of course, you can sign up to Agentive. It'll be a 48 to 72 hour wait. I apologize for the delay, but we have so many people trying to get in that we need to like batch people in as we as we go. So apologies for the delay, but it is free once you get in. So I hope you guys can make the most of this and build some awesome assistance for your business or for other businesses that you're selling to. If you do want to follow along with this build step by step and use the exact same information that I had, I'm going to be putting it all in my free resource hub down in the description so you can sign up there and get the knowledge base you can get the open ai spec everything that i've mentioned here in order to get this build will be available down in my resource hub as well if you want to learn how you can make money with open ai gpts you can check out my video here going into depth on three different ways that you can make money but aside from that that's all for the video guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in the next one